Hello, I thought I'd just make a quick demonstration of the scene drawing process that we talked about in last week's class. And you may have already tried that, and I'd like you to try it twice this week with a separation of a couple days. So the first thing is to find a simple object, and in this case I'm going to use a pine cone. Uh, organic forms are much more uh, conducive to this process, which is about relaxing and seeing the contour of an object. And contour is basically, if I spray painted this white, I'd be more aware of contour. And essentially contour is the part of something that you can touch. Uh, so for this, I'm gonna do the first steps. There's six steps to the process. The first one is actually just to gaze at the object rather than dropping right, right in and drawing it. And I'm gonna keep the object to the left and I'm right-handed, so object to the left. Pen, I'm gonna use a big pen. You can use anything, black and white, it's fine. Any, any pen or pencil is fine. I'll compress what's a 10 or 12 minute process. So first I let my eye fall upon the object. I gaze at it for a full minute. Then also before I begin to draw, I close my eyes and I, I imagine that a particular point of my eye is resting on, in this case, the pine cone. And that I'm gonna picture myself as an ant who is on the surface of the pine cone and going to go for sort of a rambling walk across the surface. Only after that two minutes of preparation do I get to the point of drawing and I open my eyes and my hand is just gonna be a seismograph tracing what my, how my eye walks over the surface. And so try to keep the paper far away from the object you're drawing and don't look at the paper during the whole drawing process. So I'm gonna plot my pen down it's all about relaxation and truly seeing this modest, organic object. And then very slowly, I'm going to begin to walk the surface of the pine cone. There's no need to draw the whole piece. It's like an ant would only, this would be a, a world it wouldn't be aware of. And notice my hand is moving at something like this pace as I'm walking back and forth along and then down some of the spurs of the pine cone leaves. It's not gonna look like the object in any photo, sort of photorealistic way. And then if you notice yourself going too fast, just try and really slow down the movement. It's a meditative process, so try to focus on just the pine cones contour for a total of at least eight minutes. You could set a timer on your phone or play two songs that were eight minutes or just approximately think, okay, that's about eight minutes. Look only at the object the entire time. Slow down, breathe deep. If your hand goes off the page, just plop your pen or pencil back down somewhere. There's no need to look at it. And it's important that you do the eight minute drawing as a single line. So you don't lift the pen or pencil from the paper. You just keep letting your eye in an ant-like way ramble over the surface. So this was only a one minute scene drawing and then I didn't look and then I get to kind of enjoy it. It's always a bit of a surprise and there is the essence of the object in this, but the point of a scene drawing is not about the object in terms of a piece of paper with a drawing on it. The point is to have an experience where you really notice something about this modest form and again, you're, you're literally walking on a physical surface with your eye. 
So that's it, try it. And then a day or two later, try it again. I'm gonna send out this uh, voice thread, which I mentioned, and I'll ask you to comment on which of those two drawing experiences was the most relaxing? Because we generally see the best when we're either very relaxed or intensely excited. See you in class this week.